Good morning, Britain. Inspiring the nation. New footage of teenage fundraiser Stephen Sutton, who died yesterday at 19, shows his unwavering determination to live life to the full. Violent protests in Turkey as the desperate search for survivors of the mine blast continues. 274 miners have been killed, with dozens still trapped underground. Social media outrage Good Morning Britain leads the campaign to force a luxury lingerie shop in New York to remove an unhealthily thin mannequin. And putting on a brave face for the critics, Nicole Kidman graces the red carpet at the Cannes Film Festival. Thursday, 15th of May, 2014, live from ITV Studios in London. This is Good Morning Britain. Good morning, I'm Susanna Reid, and look who's here. Kate Garraway joins us this morning. Hello. Hello. Welcome. Hello. Can I just say, it feels I like... I just wandered in. I fe it feels like I've woken up from a very bad dream. <laughs> Does it? I'm next to you You're again. You're grown up. Look at you I in your smart suit. I spent four years trying to get away from her. <laughs> and you've clawed your way I know. Back. It's lovely in here. I Isn't feel like it? I've made it really messy just by turning up. I think no, it's better to say you have. You fit oh, right well, in. OK, yeah. thank you. Thank you for having me. Well, thank you for being here, Kate. And I hope it's <laughs> going to be a regular occurrence. Only two and a half hours to get through. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're talking about the amazing, inspiring Stephen Sutton. Um, he inspired so many people with his really love of life, yeah, yeah. and he lost his fight, of course, with cancer yesterday. But today we are celebrating his amazing life with previously unseen footage filmed over the last year. We are going to be meeting the documentary maker who became friends with him. Really special pictures for you a little bit later on. Could there finally be an end to the IVF postcode lottery? Morning now, I'm Ben Shepherd. Health watchdog Nice says women should be given up to three lots of fertility treatment if they need it but does cash spent on making babies mean others miss out and who reads the kids their bedtime stories in your house is it mum or is it dad i'm kate garraway and most likely the answer is mum but the author behind the horrid henry books wants more dads to take up and take their turn no excuses let us know what you think yeah, it's dad in our house. Why boy bands make big bucks. I'm Sean Fletcher. One Direction have officially been named Britain's richest boy band, netting a cool 70 million between them. Not bad for five lads who were unknown wannabes just four years ago. I'm just trying to see the similarities. Unknown look wannabes. Around the, look, around <laughs> <the table. laughs> look around no, the table. Look around the table. Definitely not us. Uh, let, let's see what the weather's doing with Laura, who's on the roof of ITV Studios this morning. Good morning to you, Laura. Good morning. Well, yes, it is a stunning start to the day here on the roof. Blue skies as far as the eye can see and if you haven't got the sunshine yet you will do today and we are verging on making it the warmest day of the year so far if not today then tomorrow i'll have more on that in the next 15 minutes our top story this morning he was